All right, this is the Dude RC back at it again. The goal today really was to just uh, finally finish killing those 4S batteries I had charged up the other day to uh, do the speed pass with the felony on this road, uh, you know, when it blew the rear drive shaft. And then I tried again with him yesterday on that 19 tooth pinion and blew his tire instantaneously. Well, it's still got the 19 tooth in it, uh, but this one I'm just gonna do uh, do some small jumps and stuff. Uh, go play out in the dirt. This guy, I did pull out his 25 tooth uh, pinion that I threw in there, the optional speed pinion, where it did uh, I think like 91, 92 miles per hour, and I put the stock 18 tooth, I want to say, pinion back in it. So yeah, I'm just gonna do a quick speed run on this, just because I was curious what kind of what kind of speed we get on the stock gearing and then after that this thing is well i'm just gonna do everything i can to just shred the tires i can keep shredding the tires until i either a run out of battery or b run out of tires i brought enough for two extra swaps so i can't think anything more american than than just doing big old smoky burnouts and doing donuts and hooning around and in a killer looking american truck um you know i love my country i support our troops i support our fallen troops um you know i may not agree with everything in this country but i do still love it i do still support it so this is my little thank you to the troops thank you for the for protecting our country and securing our freedoms and uh this video is dedicated to you guys and uh so let's just get at it, man. Let's let's uh, strap the GPS on. I'm gonna go strap the Gro GoPro to my head and uh, take it for a speed run, and then uh, we'll we'll take it around these parking lots here and just uh, just light them up. Let's get it going. Whew, it's a hot one today too. All right, we got the GPS on the truck. As you can see, it is reading. So let's get you started. And let's see what she does on the stock gears. Road's nice and clear. Oh, I got a little bit of trimming to do. All right. All right, Mr. Infraction. Show us what you got. Woo! All right, did not see that piece of crap in the road there. And let me go grab the truck. <laughs> I don't think it's hurt. I think it just went into the dirt. Well, it actually went pretty far into the dirt. <laughs> Uh-oh. I don't know where the GPS is. Oh, crud. That's going to be kind of a hard one to find. Let me get back to you guys here in just a moment. All right, so after some searching, I was able to find it over there buried high in the high grass but uh thank god i found that thing because golly those things are expensive and that would have made this a very expensive video so let's try this again fortunately the truck didn't suffer any damage on that one it was pretty soft where it landed actually i Get a little bit of heat in those tires. All right, now I think we are good to go. All right, Mr. Infraction, show me what you got on your stock gears. Damn it, did it again. Thing. I strapped the uh, performance analyzer down inside this time. I think I might have a tire that's going out. Well, this time at least it didn't lose a lose a performance meter. Um, well, did 75 again. Okay, so third time has got to be the charm, right? I had my ABC turned up just a bit too high, so I think that was the problem there is 
is it was uh, <laughs> overcorrecting a little bit too much. So we try this again. All right, Mr. Infraction. <laughs> he gets wild on these tires. Gold hoons aren't really the best for this, but uh, you know, I'm going to take that. <laughs> And we see what it did. Okay, so we see we are still reading. Eighty-one. Not bad for the stock gears. Let's see what kind of temperatures we're hitting. Uh, One hundred and sixty-three. Yeah, she's cooking a little bit, but uh, if you could tell by the glistening of my arms, it is a hot day. Hot, hot day. So now, let's just go burn some tires up on this thing. Let's go over to the parking spot. All right, now it's time to turn and burn. I can't think of anything more American than doing burnouts and doing donuts with the American flag planted on your car. And this is just with the stock gear. This truck is all stock except for bigger, uh, bigger cooling fans on the motor. There we go. Now we got some snow coming off of her. Thermal there, 260 degrees. <laughs> oh, I wasn't expecting to actually hit uh, ESC thermal before uh, blowing out the tires or blowing out or wearing out the battery. But who it is a hot, muggy day. Well, maybe we can get a little bit more run out of it, but. Wish you could smell that burning rubber. Well, that's it. We hit thermal again. <laughs> All right, let's go play with the Super Rock Ray a little bit. So I have a goal for the uh, infraction was to uh, run them until some tires popped. <laughs> the temperatures had other plans. So the goal for this one is to just have some fun with it and take it off some sweet jumps and just see if it can actually come home alive. It'd probably come home a lot more alive if I didn't flip it like that. I'm still running that 19 tooth pinion in this thing, so gotta make sure I ah, ouch. stay away from wide open throttle. <laughs> I don't want to pop another front tire since I don't have any more spares for it, but 
This thing is such an animal. It's a beast. My depth perception off today. Oh, she's kind of wild. <laughs> It's an animal of a truck. hurt when they pelt you. And there's the somersault. And that's nice with aluminum knuckles because they don't crack. That's a big old rock. <laughs> truck. You ever take it off any sweet jumps? You got like three feet of air that time. I think I'm gonna leave the jumps to the professionals. <laughs> With all the rain we've had and then how hot it is today, it just hard packed this topsoil. So, as you can see, it, it's, uh, it's got a combination of very, very high grip with a whole lot of no grip. So every time I was trying to, trying to punch it towards that, uh, the ramp, I was good. I was losing it. <laughs> so we're just gonna hoon around with this thing. 
I can't believe the amount of punishment this thing has been taking with all of those bad jumps, bad landings. And she's still going strong. Yeah, those, uh, those aluminum front uh, uh, spindles, steering knuckles, they definitely, uh, I don't know if that's the only weak link with this truck, but it's been the only one that I found. And uh, these aluminum ones are definitely getting the job done. Because I am not being nice to this thing. Yow, those rocks. <laughs> You know, the, the Super Baja Ray is a better handling truck. Um, I don't know if it's just because a little bit of a difference in the steering geometry or maybe a little bit of the because of the tires, but the Super Rock Ray is just, just a blast. This thing shoots rocks like nothing. And maybe that's why they call it the Super Rock Ray. Oh, poor ramp. Poor truck. But I still don't think anything's hurt. Yeah, they might have a little bend on this one rear wheel. But... It don't seem to care. But I had to get, I had to drop down the power on those 4S batteries. Um, you know, I know they're smart batteries; they'll go into into uh, self storage after a few days. But usually, if I got a battery charge, I wanna I wanna run it. I don't want it to just uh, run out of power, which I think we just did. Yep, we are out of power. All right. So that was the run with the Rock Ray, the run with the uh, with the infraction. I think that's a good way to finish out this uh, beautiful Memorial Day. This hot, hot Memorial Day. Well, we can't end this Memorial Day video without at least blowing one tire. So let's do the old burnout. Well, well, might not have blown a tire, but I think we just blew the center diff. <laughs> all right, well, then that definitely makes an end to this video. Hope you all have a wonderful Memorial Day weekend. It's the dude RC. A little bit of bonus footage here. Yeah, we got them tires down to grease and you can't ouch yeah you can't even touch them but i don't know if the camera's focusing well enough on there that center diff i melted it I've, which is neat for me because i've never uh i've never exploded a arma center diff before like that or ever so yay time for some more metal upgrades